You must think me some sort of freak. A girl who can bring dead men back to life. Whose only acquaintance is a, a giant bird creature. It must seem ridiculous. You just got dealt a bad hand. I am not going back to that tower no matter what happens. They won't stop until they have you. Why? What did I do to them? You frightened them. Good. This is what they want, brothers. To keep you so hungry, you can't speak but to me. To keep you so ignorant, you can't think of solutions to all your problems. To keep you chasing that almighty silver eagle so you can buy everything they're selling to keep you down. Maybe Daisy's right. Maybe she should pay him back for all of this. Not before she pays us. We're here for guns and then the airship. Back it up, Scal. Thiefing Play. I might just smell some of the gloom. Will the circle be unbroken by and by? By and is a better home awaiting in the sky in the sky when you Force deep underground, well, you see things from the bottom up. And down at the bottom of the city, I saw a fire burning. A fire's got heat of plenty, but it ain't got no mouth. Daisy. Now she got herself a mouth big enough for all the fires in Columbia. Come on, come on! Hurry up! Hit it! Hit it harder! 
Elizabeth! Much obliged. People are treated like men, and others like animals. There's plenty of places down below where you'll find more of the same. Like a wounded knee. Yeah, like a wounded knee. We're gonna have to get through an army to get those tools. That the gunsmith was making weapons for the box. We squashed that gunsmith like a bug and took his tools for our own. Make no mistake, soldiers. The box and weapons go
Much obliged! traps around the lines up here. Idea was to, to bleed one of your couriers till he gave you up. Except, of course, you're using kids now. Now I got this tiny engine boy eyeballing me. Tried to take his leg off. Things just lying here between us. I sure wish he'd cry or something. Got a lock here. Give me something challenging. All yours. Much obliged.
They argued something fierce at night, Lady Comstock and the Prophet. Could never make out what it was about from my bunk, though. After the worst, I seen she ain't left for morning prayer. So I crept upstairs to check in on her. And like a fool, I lingered. Scullery maid was what they called me when I walked into Comstock House. Murderer was what they shouted when I ran out. the job and there's life. They pay me to hate the goddamn Vox and I take their money, but what's the harm of having a drink with Fitzroy's people? Face to face at the graveyard shift while they're, they're just folk. Well, I guess I fell into the goddamn bottle because I stumbled back without the evidence locker key. <laughs> if Schmidt finds out, well, there'll be hell to pay. Feel better already. Now we just have to get them back to the Vox, and then we get our airship. Elizabeth? Got it. It's be helping by getting guns for the Vox Popula. It's gonna help us. Lizzie can make a change, can't she? Make things better for the people here. Sure. Well, we sure as hell aren't going to be able to carry all this back to the shop. God, we didn't think this all the way through. What is that? It's like a tear. Another version of this room that doesn't have any tools in it. Well, if the tools aren't in there, then... Back at the shop. If we go into this tear, I don't think there's any turning back. Are you sure you want to go now? Let's head back to the gunsmith and finish our deal. I aim to be on that airship and well shut of this place for long. Okay, if the Vox get their weapons, there's going to be a revolution just like that. These people are going to have better lives. Yeah.
You ever see a forest at the beginning of a fire? For the first flame, you see them possums and squirrels running through the trees. They know what's coming. But the fat bears with their bellies full of honey, well, you can't hardly wake them up from their comfortable hibernation. We're going to Emporium, and then we gonna see what it takes to rouse them from their slum. Daisy's moved to these people. Things can change, Booker, and we can be a part of it. I don't want to be a part of it. Once we get our airship, we'll be well shut of this place. In this world, you're a hero. I, I remember I led the Vox. I, S Slate and I burned down the Hall of Heroes. The nose. Hard to think of. Just two memories in the same Hooker, place. Hooker, come back to me. 
We're going to find Daisy Fitzroy. Then we're getting out of here, First Lady. Let's go. this recording and remember that I am the proudest woman in Colombia to have been your wife. They said your soul was choked by the fumes in that metal box, but this I do not believe. And we shall meet again on that eternal shore. Both of us whole and smiling. I love you. I love you. I love you. down to it. The only difference between Comstock and Fitzroy is how you spell the name. 